Sir last but not least, how uh, for uh, activating domestic tours will raise the awareness of our great heritage? Uh, I mean, activating domestic tours does raise awareness. So raising awareness is very important, especially in a country that accommodates more than two-thirds of the ancient monuments of the world, like Egypt. So uh, you cannot raise awareness un unless people know and see their heritage. So when you, when you uh, encourage domestic tourism, this goes parallel with sustainability and keeps the side going, especially uh, that we have been passing through lots of uh, pandemics. I mean, we're talking about the, uh, the the COVID, and then not only. I mean, very shortly after the COVID, we had this uh, this uh, this trouble that happened between uh, Ukraine and Russia, and then so. Uh, Domestic tourism, we are 120 million who live in Egypt, and uh, if we encourage Egyptians to travel domestically, in, I mean, there are like 5 million Egyptians who travel abroad. So if we encourage them to, to travel domestically, that will be good for the economy, and that will be good for sustainability, and that will be good also for raising awareness, because they will know their heritage, and they will know how to protect it, and they will appreciate it more. Uh, Dr. Uh, Amr uh, Atif, uh, touristic expert and PhD sustainable heritage tourism expert as well. Uh, thank you very much, sir, for joining us in today's episode of uh, Nile Cruise. And thank you very much for your informative and a very, inf a very important, interesting uh, interview that made and added uh, so much knowledge to, our, to all of us and to the uh, viewers that are watching. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Thank you. Very kind. Thank you.